states, closing the gap with more school buses. Tonight, a new bill in the California Senate would establish a state-funded school bus program providing free transportation to every student. Now, its goal is to stop kids from missing school and even the playing field for all students, regardless of income. CBS 13's Laura Hayfley is live in Sacramento with one teacher who says this move, Laura, is a long time coming. As you just mentioned, this is free school bus rides for all California students to and from school. It's a policy that's actually currently not in place in California. So how much will this all cost? The teacher we spoke to says she doesn't care. She just wants to see students back in her classroom. Oh, I haven't had a full class um, in weeks. Sixth grade teacher Jordan Robinson is counting down the days until students are back in class. And I'll probably have a party. I'd be like, we're all here. <laughs> it's not COVID-19 preventing Natoma's Unified School District students from being inside the classroom. It's that some can't even get there because busing isn't provided for everyone. I have parents who work the night shifts and they don't get home till almost eight o'clock. And then either their child is late for school or they're like, yeah, I just couldn't get them there. State Senator Nancy Skinner says she has a solution, a state-funded school bus program that would provide free transportation for all students. We know that students with home-to-school transport miss fewer days of school, and they're more likely to graduate. But who pays for it? We're getting answers. Though Senator Skinner's proposal was not specific, the money would come from the state's general fund and promises districts the resources needed to attract bus drivers with more competitive wages and benefits. Right now, only 9% of our kids are getting, getting school-provided transportation. You have chronic absenteeism among some children who can't get to school. It affects attendance and it affects people's learning. Several districts in Northern California don't provide school buses to students. San Juan Unified School District in Sacramento County eliminated their general school bus program in 2011. And Natomas Unified School District does not provide transportation for everyone. If the bill passes, districts will have until the 2023-2024 school year to implement the program.